next video, we have a steel screw, some iron pins and a magnet. When we take the steel screw and we check if the steel screw can attract the iron pins, it's clear that it cannot attract the iron pins, right? The steel screw does not have magnetic properties. But if we bring the magnet close to the steel screw, it gets attracted to the steel screw and now you can use this steel screw to lift the iron pins up, right? Have a look. Now when I bring it close, the steel screw starts acting like a magnet, right? You can notice that the iron pins are stuck very strongly to the steel screw, right? But what happens if I detach the steel screw from the magnet? Wow, now the steel screw does not act like a magnet, right? So there's something interesting about this. Only when the steel screw is attached to the magnet does, this, does the steel screw act like a magnet. The moment we detach the steel screw from the magnet, watch again, the moment we detach the steel screw from the magnet, the steel screw's magnetic properties disappear. Look at that. Amazing, isn't it? You'll notice though that one pin just does not fall down, right? Now, why does that happen? That's because the steel screw was attached to the magnet for quite some time, right? And so the steel screw kind of picked up the magnetic property of the magnet. But you'll notice that this magnetic property of the steel screw isn't very strong. If I tried to pick up pins again with the steel screw, it just doesn't work, right? So there is some tiny bit of magnetism transferred onto the steel screw from the magnet, but not too much. Okay, let's review what we just saw. We saw that when the steel screw was far away from the permanent magnet, it could not act as a magnet, right? But we noticed when the steel screw was close to the permanent magnet, the steel screw itself became a temporary magnet. This is called induced magnetism. Let me just formally write down what induced magnetism is before we close this video. So, uh, when a magnetic substance turns into a temporary magnet, here the steel screw turned into a temporary magnet because of a permanent magnet that is nearby. Okay, so it's pretty clear in this case, the steel screw displays induced magnetism. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.